You know, when people often ask me, what is the burden of diabetes in India? If you look at the latest IDF Atlas, which was released in December 2017, it's close to 73 million. And then a huge number of our patients do not know they have diabetes because it is asymptomatic. Now, this is the big problem that we are seeing. And we have a huge number of patients also with impaired glucose tolerance and close to 10% of them are moving towards diabetes. So the problem is huge for a country like India. I belong to a family who is suffering from diabetes for past uh, two, three generations. So it's, it's not new for me. This condition impacts every vital organ in the system. So the insurers really do not know what they are looking at. And that's why the pricing will be slightly more conservative and they will insist on better control because better control is the only thing which can contain this damage. The first line of treatment is usually lifestyle modification and behavior change. Well, the problem is that in India, this line of therapy, which is the first line of therapy, is existing in a very small way or sometimes not existing at all. Once the patient has left your clinic after medical consultation, till the next medical consultation, what patient is doing is very difficult to track. And we have to believe whatever patient tells us when patient comes us next time. And that is the reason the lifestyle modification for a patient who have diabetes in India is really very, very difficult. And that we are seeing in a poor outcome in terms of getting poor control for diabetic patients. There was a need that we could clearly see was necessary to solve for the state of diabetes in this country. We spoke to payers, we spoke to providers, we spoke to patients, and it was really apparent that there was a problem that existed across all three which could only be solved by a solution that today did not exist, which is where we built out this company called Wealthy Therapeutics and Digital Therapeutics as a new category of medicine to combat the growing burden of type 2 diabetes in South Asia. Wealthy Diabetes Therapeutic has worked in a session with Research Society for study of diabetes in India in developing this artificial intelligence system and since then it has gone a long way. It has evolved like a very good intelligent partner in management of the patient. Patient centricity is the core mantra of our therapy and one of the key aspects of this therapy is patient engagement and uh, the way it helps us is the more we engage with patients, uh, the greater we get to know about them. It gives us uh, data uh, that was previously unknown about the patient lifestyle journey and that coupled with their uh, medical history uh, gives us uh, amazing benefits, amazing insights. The core weapon that we use in our program is the health coach. She's the face of our program. She's the front line with whom the patient interacts and shares their information with. My health coach Rituja has helped me a lot. She has given me a small advice on uh, different things. Number one, I can say that water intake has increased. Then uh, my exercise uh, level has increased a lot. I started doing exercise every day, not on, only on the weekends. My food proportion has also changed a lot. Earlier I didn't know what proportion I have to take for the carbohydrate, protein and fats. Now I knew that. We can figure out, uh, based on a patient's clinical and behavioral uh, notes, when he likes to be active, for example. Does he like to be active? Where does he like to be active? And based on those things, we can send very specific nudges to the user at very specific times. Not only it will help patient themselves, what's their information you're collecting over three months that is also going back into their file to the physician. So next time patient comes to the physician, probably patient cannot conceal whether he followed or whether he didn't follow the drug therapy, whether he followed diet and lifestyle modification instruction or no. So patient is in a much better position. It is going to help them in overall management and in the long run may actually improve the compliance of the patient and adherence to the therapy as well as their linkage to the physician will also probably improve. We actually selected a group of patients. In fact, this abstract is there at the ADA at Orlando this year. It, it was a sizable number to give us enough power to get the statistical thing. And what we found was, we found a reduction of about 0.8% in HbA1c without making any alterations in their medication. It was only the app 
which constantly started talking to the patients. And that's the reason we call that this wealthy therapeutic app is in a digital pill, which is much more than any other anti-diabetic pill. Our therapy is very different. Our therapy is real time. Our therapy is data driven. Insurers work on data. You give them more data, better quality data, real time data, they will give you better products at a better price. So if that gap can be bridged, they will be very willing to have very good products at a very, I can say, very good price. We are on a mission to be able to reduce, prevent or control the chronic illnesses of 10 million patients by 2025. In the process, we also want to save up to $10 billion of payer costs or national health system costs. Our goal is to be a mission-driven, value-driven digital therapeutic company that is able to improve patient outcomes clinically, reproducibly, and scalably, not just in India, but across multiple markets in Asia and the world.